Welcome back and good morning everyone. Today I'm going to show you a quick and easy do-it-yourself glass bottle and crystal wind chime using very simple um, craft supplies. The first thing you're going to need is a um, hanging basket. I got this from Tractor Supply and I moved the chain from the top to the bottom of the basket because we're going to turn this over and use this to hang all our little glass bottles and crystals. So I just moved the um, chains to the bottom of the basket and next you'll just collect some uh, small glass bottles. You could use the different color glass bottles. You're going to need some um, wire, some 20 gauge wire, and some crystals. So let's get started on this quick and easy project. The first thing to do is to take the wire and we're going to wrap around the neck of the bottles. Now this wire is black and I was able to find it at Walmart in the jewelry making section. Um, you can find it in the floral but it's always green and I want it black. So I got this from the jewelry section where you make your own jewelry. And I just wrapped it around three times around um, the neck of the bottle and then um, carefully took the, the rest of the piece and wound it around the wire. Then I'm using some snips to just to kind of fold those um, edges down and tighten them. And basically I wanted the biggest bottle in the middle kind of up higher than the smaller bottles. So I went ahead and measured out um, all my pieces of wire and make sure you wear safety glasses or some kind of glasses because this wire was everywhere when you're doing this project and so all of the smaller bottles are going to be at the same height and the larger bottle which is going to be in the middle is a little shorter height so I had all that done before I started wrapping and that's the same process you just wrap it around three times and then tighten it kind of gave myself almost three inches to start wrapping. One, two, and you can see I didn't quite make three, but it's good to have at least three um, wraparounds. And then you just snip those little ends shut, tight so they're not sticking out. And that's it. Next is the crystals, and these already had um, holes in them, and you can get these at um, antique stores or junk thrift flea markets, you can find these. And I just pump, put it through the hole, and then just the same process, just wrapped it around really, really tight. So I'm going to put a crystal between each small bottle on the chandelier or wind chime, whatever you want to call it. I called it a wind chime because I have it outside on my porch, but it could be a little chandelier and hang it inside. So I did the same process with all these little crystals. I really like the idea of the different color glass bottles like greens and blues. Um, so when I go thrift store shopping, I'll start looking for those bottles and maybe purchasing some of those and make another one with the different colors. Okay, now I'm going to take the basket and start attaching all of these um, bottles and crystals. Starting with the middle bottle will go up and I will hook it up in the top of that basket. And I didn't realize my um, camera lens did not capture that but um, I did wrap that around that cross section at the very top and wound it around several times and got it really really tight and then um, secured the edge with the snips making sure it was nice and tight there it goes I sh I'm showing you now I just went round and round and round so it's nice and secure And I kind of held it up and decided if that was the right height or not, and I felt like it was. So now I'm going to start attaching um, the, the smaller bottles. And I kind of started it, made the circle in half and put one bottle on one side and the other bottle on the other side. 
and then half again until I got all my bottles positioned equally on the basket. You can use any size. These um, hanging baskets come in all shapes and sizes. I just happened to pick this one up, but they come in a variety, oblong, smaller sizes, so you can make any kind of um, hanging wind chime. Okay, I've almost got all of the bottles secured to the wire basket. And then I'll start with the crystals, which is very easy. You put those, I put those between the smaller bottles on the outer edge. And just carefully wrapping it, giving it a lot of nice turns so that it was secure and won't fall off. Okay, I think I've got, well, I've got three done that I'm going to put on another and just keep repeating the process and then adding on the crystals. This is such a fun project. I love sitting down and doing these kind of crafts when I'm home by myself. So everything was attached and then I went back and I shortened uh, my chain to the right um, height for where I'm going to hang this and I added this really pretty green artificial um, ivy piece with the little tiny um, fruit and it looked really pretty. It's going to look nice on my front porch and then I hung it up and that's it. That's all you have to do. You could put some of those dry air ferns that you see in the store in, in a couple of the bottles, but I thought it was fun. If you like this, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe and leave me a comment below if you like this idea. Thank you so much for joining me and have a very blessed day.